So hello guys, it's me Michelle. So on today's episodes of Kids Creation, I will be reviewing an anime movie called Ride Your Wave. Ride Your Wave was directed by Masaki Iwasa, which also directed an anime called Devilman Crybaby. It also have a manga adaptation by Reiko Yoshida. So I already watched that movie two months ago. Yeah. So like this movie was one hour and a half long. So I recommend you guys to bring your water beside you to hydrate and a tissue to wipe those tears because I promise you that you will cry like a baby if you're an emotional crackhead like me because I cried so bad. <laughs> Alright, back to the review. It is a story about a surfer named Hinako, the female protagonist who just moved to the seaside small town and a firefighter named Minato. Basically, they met, they fall in love, and they became a couple. You know, that stuff. <laughs> it was so cute. They were so happy together. They date, they talk about their interests, their future ahead. It was so romantic, like nothing could go wrong. Everything was perfect. <laughs> then this one day, the boyfriend, he died. Yep, he died of drowning in a beach at the beach. It was sad. Super sad. It crushed me. I now feel like I wanna cry again after this. So after Hinako went through an awful grief phase, but yeah, she's still grieving about her boyfriend's death. She ends up seeing Minato in the water. In the water. Is he is she hallucinating or something? Like she's wondering is he actually there or not? We don't know. No one else could see Minato except for Hinako. Her friends thought that whenever <clears throat> Her friends thought that Hinako is just having a ding dong here, you know, like, is he crazy? Hinako tried her best to convince her friends that whenever she sing their song, their official song, their favorite song, Minato will magically appear on water. Yup, you wanna see the example? <laughs> it's like this. She'll hold, hold the water, right? <laughs> and she'll sing this song. Kimi ga nagamete iru minamo wa azayaka ni kirameki. And yeah, Minato will appear here and she will talk to the bottle bottle. The image of Minato will appear here. I wish I could. I wish I can do that too, cause it was cool. Cause you can speak to the spirit. <laughs> so Hinako tried to keep the relationship going while Minato is one with the water like they cannot hug each other physically because it's only the hallucination of Minato but we don't know how long will Minato be there and that sad sad premise it was depressing <laughs> ah. so in my opinion about the animation this all the characters that was made by Yuasa is so creative, unique, it's not that wild, so colorful, there's so much variety of it, lovely. <laughs> 
This soundtrack is great. This song is much more cooler and sad and depressing. <laughs> You'll be fine. You'll be fine. So in this movie, the genre in this movie is, I think, it's romance, slice of life, supernatural elements, mind games, and grief. Let's not forget about it. <laughs> but while watching this movie, you will not be stressed out that much because it is more to like calm scene with a bit of crazy moments. It was fun. Oh yeah, the water. The water is... A huge part of what connects their relationship as the girlfriend, the, Mina, uh, the Hinako is the surfer genius who teach her boyfriend how to surf and Minato is a firefighter who extinguish the fire by using water. <laughs> Yeah, it was fun and entertaining but this one I felt like there was a lot of emotional weight when it came to the journey of the characters. Yeah, honestly, I teared up every time I watched that movie. I thought that I'm gonna pass out, you know, pengsan because <laughs> I'm out of breath every time. <laughs> so that's all for me. You guys should watch Ride Your Wave movie after this. <laughs> It is super recommended for anyone who would like to have a good cry, promise me. <laughs> and after that, after you guys have watched that, if you guys don't mind, you can write a comment below of what are your thoughts about that movie. I will read it. And also, don't forget to like and subscribe the Kids Creation channel. Thank you!